mission, the ex Cerberus guy was bragging about how many kills he had. Ah, not about competition, about saving galaxy as a team. You are totally right. Totally right. So, if you want, we could, I don't know, trade N7 operative intel? So if you ever wanted to deploy together... What right for you to use? Oh, it's a Widow. A Widow 3, in fact. We get to Widow 10, you call me. you get your lead actor to work with a live Pijak? Oh, he came around once I explained the Pijak's importance to the production. They'll work marvelously together. Once the Pijak stops scaling the set pieces and making nests out of the props. Oh, my. Not to worry, productions always appear disastrous until just before the curtain rises. Oh, of course. It's going to be an amazing show. I won't lie. I've got a good Welcome to Castle Arcade. Enemies approaching.
score!
seconds. That's a new high score. Take that. Welcome to Castle Arcade. And then I take your homework. That was fun. I... you... Where did you learn to play like that? Mostly through observation. Your matches are especially educational. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Would you like to play another game? Sure. You go first. Good enough. What are you doing here? Uh, escaping. Ever since we cured the genophage, it's been nothing but work. Council been riding you? Bah! Not those Pajak shit slingers. No, it's the. It's the female shepherd. Now that they're fertile again. Oh, I haven't slept in. I don't know how long. Can I get you two anything? Two more drinks. And another bag of ice. I would have thought you'd be enjoying the perks of Krogan fertility. Enjoying it? There's a line of females outside my dwelling right now. It stretches on for as far as you can see. I had to sneak out my own bathroom window. Even then, I was cornered by two more females on the ride from Tuchonka. And it's just you. They're not spreading the love around? Sure, but everyone wants their firstborn in generations to be strong and fit. I'm the leader of Clan Erdnot. I brought an end to the genophage. Everyone on Tuchonka wants a piece of me. And Bakar is no help at all. She encourages it. I'm telling you, Shepard, I'm in no shape to fight Reapers. Aren't you in charge? They could at least hold off until after the war. You've never been stalked by a fertile Krogan female, Shepard. There is no holding off, just holding. Here are your drinks. And a bag of ice. I thought Morden's procedure was painful. Oh well. <laughs> Shit, Shepard. We sure have been through it, haven't we? Still going through it. <laughs> True. Well, here's to us. And to going through it. I'll drink to that. Carbal! It means victory or death, roughly. Ah, but you can't die, Rex. You got a family now. A really big family. Ah, more ice! I've seen enough. You know what, man? I'm done here. 
couldn't have put it better myself. Yeah. Well, pretty good act for a pit boss. I've seen better though. Shut it and finish up. If I see you in here tomorrow, Mr. Bates, you'll be sorry for it. Fighting any other races? Bit of everything. Served with some humans, and one Drell who was really annoying. We'd finished off a wave and were regrouping, and this Justicar and I set off heavy biotic blasts. Yeah, like you do. And then the Drell just wades in and starts kicking the air for no reason. Why the hell would he do that? I have no idea. Try our quad kicker cocktail in the Silver Sun Bar on the second floor. Joined up with Turians on this drop into one of their colonies. I was thinking, finally, some normal soldiers like me. Then we deploy, and you know what those crazy birds bust out? Jet boots. Jet boots? I mean, what frontline soldier needs a pair of damn jet boots? It's just showing off to what it is. Good news. Procurement has authorized you for the Grawl Spike Thrower Mark 7. What? What? But I'm an adept. I don't use shotguns. Well, the Brawl 7 is one of the best heavy shotguns available. We don't just give them to anyone. I don't use shotguns, ever. Do you know what carrying something that heavy would do to my cooldown time? I'd go through entire missions without firing my gun. I wouldn't even carry one if not for Alliance Rex. Feel free to look around or browse our catalog. Welcome. I came as quickly as I could. What's wrong? I didn't mean to worry you. When I saw you were on the Citadel, I wanted to see you again. We've said our farewells, Shepard. Are we gonna stand on formalities? These big picture windows remind me of our talks in the Normandy's observation lounge. This view doesn't have quite the same effect as a galaxy of stars. But I can see where it might make one sentimental. I also enjoyed our talks, Shepard. Very much. What should we do to take our mind off things for a couple of hours? Let's watch people. Justicars must have keen powers of perception. Testing them can be fun. Really? Yes. For example, the Turian there. The one limping. What do you suppose his story is? Injured in military service, probably. Except he doesn't wear it like a badge of honor. He seems ashamed. Whatever happened, I would guess he's an outcast. What about the two Volus? 
the ones whispering. What's in the case? They're related. Brothers, but also business partners. The one on the left is a drunk and has put the family fortune in jeopardy through risky business dealings. But now the Blue Sons have kidnapped his wife. His brother has brought the ransom. 2.3 million credits. You can see all that. No, I made it up. You see? Fun. Okay. The Elcor with the umbrella. Go. Too easy, Shepard. What about me, then? Too difficult. I think that you are remarkable, Shepard. When the Vids sing your praises and call you a hero, does it make you blush? Do you agree? What do you feel? It's humbling. But honestly, if people feel that I'm making a difference, that bolsters me, my team, and our efforts. What now? I am content as we are, Shepard. Let us sit a while longer, even if there is nothing to say. Shepard here. Hi, Mom. Oh, honey. Oh, it's so good to hear your voice. This is a surprise. It's been a long time. It has. I, I just felt I needed to... I think about you every day. I try not to worry. The other day, I was remembering the bedtime stories we used to make up. You had your own ship and crew. The stories were always filled with adventure and danger. Yeah. Huh. I haven't thought about that in a while. <laughs> Me neither. Oh, you'd always swoop in to punish the bad guys to save the day. So, there you are. Even when you were little, you dreamed of the life you have. Is that the reason you wanted me to call? No. I just want you to know that I am proud of you, honey. So proud. So what? A private cabin on a stealth warship isn't enough for you? I'm watching the place for a friend. What are you doing? Calling Izo. Izo? <laughs> yeah, he's from Thessia. Naturally biotic from all the element zero. Their biotics make them short-tempered, so a lot of them get abused or abandoned. Can you imagine someone doing that? I found him at a rescue place. I'm trying to teach him that it's okay to trust people. He started out really angry, but I've been giving him lots of love, and now he's a big old softie. Oh. What? He seems like a good... pet. Yeah. Who's my badass biotic? Mm, who's my badass biotic? <laughs> Sorry we're late. Somebody forgot to pick up the cerveza. Come on in. That somebody was you. Didn't say it was. So when's the game? It's about to start. Seattle Sorcerers versus Usaru Maestros. Gonna be some intense by Audible. Nah, it's just a goodwill game for troop morale. They'll take it easy. In the middle of a war with their troops watching, they'll give it their all. 
Absolutely. Have you guys seen Derek Rogers' game lately? Man, he and the Sorcerers have been tearing it up. Esteban, the Maestros don't lose. Have you seen Tyra Tassanis play? The woman is blue lightning. Mr. Vega, your love of the Asari team has more to do with how they look than how they play. Hey, that's not true. Not entirely. Besides, you telling me you don't got the hots for some of the sorcerers? Okay, okay. Guilty as charged. Who are you backing, Shepard? I'm not sure. What do you guys think? Uh, the Seattle Sorcerers are one of the few human b-ball teams left. They were on tour when Earth was hit. Since acquiring Donna Novotny from the Hackers, they've been completely unstoppable. Yeah, but most of the Maestros have been playing since before First Contact. They'll win this. I know the Sorcerers have never beaten the Maestros, but they've never been this hungry either. So, Shep, who's it gonna be? You don't bet against the home team. Mr. Vega, I hope you're hungry for humble pie. When has our commander ever been wrong? Come on, man, the game's starting. Merda, he was out! You're blind, ref! Yes! They did it! Now pay up. Hey, why didn't you let me in on the betting? We weren't exactly betting on who'd win. We were betting on if you'd pick the winner. And everyone knows you don't bet against Shepard. Anyway, it was a hell of a game. Yeah, great evening. Thank you, Shepard. My pleasure. Tomorrow comes early. Hasta luego. We're happy to fulfill all your household needs.